Okay guys, welcome to my channel. Today we're going to make a digital clock in Python. So let's start going. Um, we're gonna use a model called Dikinter. We're gonna import everything from that. And from in the dot tickle k we're gonna import I mean everything send from time we're gonna import stiff time S T R F D R M B don't forget the spelling root is going to be tk as so in that case should not be in caps sorry for that then root dot title so i'm gonna give it as um clock that simple so I'm going to define time. So for that self and I'm going to make a string which equals stuff time and then in that self we're going to import string. It's going to be like this part to um, let me see um, minute and then a minute then comes seconds and then comes oh nothing wait 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 some yeah this comes here p then in stuff time we're gonna make a extra space right here that's it bring this over now we're gonna label dot configure I mean config in short form it's going to be the text it's going to be string yeah so label dot after I'm gonna keep it as thousand comma time so you get the right time like 60 hours 60 minutes 60 seconds i mean 24 12 yeah label is going to be label with the capital l then root root uh, font is going to be let me say Bracket. Cut this file from internet. Yes, it's digital. Yeah, I got this form from Google. Yes, that will be good. It's going to be a shading. Sorry, sorry, I don't try. My system slow. Okay, and uh, background or video or whatever. It's going to be as black because I love that black background. It will be nice and then foreground. Okay, do you know what's foreground? It's it will measure the you know like something what we call time we can see the digital time right nine six one two and etc etc that will be highlighted in this color sign that's it and then label dot i'm going to keep it as back uh, yeah bank anchor and then anchor is going to be in center yeah, yeah sorry center uh in center you do just don't forget to put the strings okay then uh, time it's going to be I'll just define it later 
it's going to be like this. I just want to define the time. So I just, you know, like, get something, some input for time. Just don't know what to. Okay, uh, let me keep it simple. The time is, that's it. Then cyan, oh, there's some problem in cyan. I think it's, it should be in strings, yeah. Yeah, man, strings. It's all strings. I mean, strings, cyan. That should do it. Wait, what? Ah, yeah. Let's run that. See if it works. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh my god, this is good. See the clock right here, showing the right time here, I think so. Yeah, 12.13 p.m. right here in India. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye.